So right now I'm going to have my breakfast and I'm also getting a little bit of a out. Like I said, a bit of cracks. But um, I know my oven was a little bit too hot. Welcome to my channel, my name is Gail and let's get into the video.
So this is my second cup of water. I already had some. Um, so yeah. And then this is my, I think it's my second cup of coffee. Um, and this is a protein coffee. It's a very soft coffee. So just instant coffee with some protein. And I make myself a, not a lot of protein, but it just changes the taste. And I enjoy it. I don't know what I'm gonna make this morning to eat. I'm still contemplating I actually feel like an egg, but I think I should maybe just have some oats and then I'll have like an egg or eggs for the afternoon because I'm gonna, I'm aiming to make a curry if I'm feeling up to it. I'm going to do some cleaning today and either start painting today, finish up the painting today or tomorrow. And then I'm going to edit again because I haven't done any of those type of things. Uh, I didn't sleep well last night. I finally got to sleeping around four, I think. Uh, no, three. And I kept on waking up. So I got up a bit late. And I got a late start to my day. But yeah, I don't want to do too much because I'm still sort of just healing myself. So exercising is out of the question. And that's 14 grams. I know that peanut butter is high in calories. So this is 14 grams and a serving is 15. A single serving is 15. Maybe it's just my eyes that can't see things. Anyway, it's, um, a single serving is 15 grams. Um... 360 kilojoules so that's less than a hundred calories I make sure to add the peanut butter into the calories that I want to um, eat in the morning I spread the peanut butter out a little bit and I added some more cinnamon and I also made it with stevia. I'm going to have a snack. I'm not really hungry. I know you should eat when you're hungry. But I do feel like having um, a fruit. And so this is what I'm going to have. This is just some washing in the kitchen that I have to pack away. Or fold and pack. And also have some ingredients for pasta for tonight that I have to probably leave it there because I'm making I'm making some um, pasta a pasta dish tonight I've got my eggs boiling and over here I just made this I don't know what it's called um, my teacher showed our class how to make this in the 12th grade or is it now 11th grade? I can't quite remember. But this was great. We used to run away from our English class and just say like, ah, oh, I think it was a home, e home economics teacher. Well, it was called that back in the day. Um, needed us to come and finish up something, but we lied. We just went to go make these because we were bored. And this is just... Well, we obviously made it in a bigger batch back then, but this is, I just, I'm out of bread and I need something to go with my eggs. And so this is a single serving, which is 42 grams of flour, just a little bit of um, baking powder and some salt and lukewarm water and get it into a batter like this. And then I'm just going to fry it off in a pan and you can top it with whatever you like. 
so you can see this is going. I could have probably done. Oh, my dog. I could have probably done two smaller ones in a pan, but I want to do like just one big one. I'm going to wait for it to bubble a little bit more and then I'm going to um, flip it. You can see the way it looks now. It's more like bubbles and stuff and it's, it's moving easy so it's ready to be flipped. Look at that, beautiful. It's like a pancake basically, <laughs> just without any extra ingredients. No sugar, no eggs, no milk, no oil, just very plain. And I'm going to turn the heat off and just let it sit and cook through in the hot pan. Right, so I went very savory with this. Margarine with a bit of um, garlic, some rosemary, some salt and cayenne pepper on my two eggs. And that's what I'm having for lunch. I'm still hungry. It's 5.59 I've been up since 5 o'clock There's my water and my protein coffee for the morning I already made up my bed That's just my notepad I'm going to sketch out my to-do list for the day And my little throw blankie that I'm going to lay under while I drink my coffee Right, so I'm having oats this morning and I ran out of milk so I used some protein powder with some hot water to make my oats and topped it with peanut butter. Right, so I'm about to take my vitamins and I've already taken these out. This one is my cod liver oil tablet. This one is my vitamin C, this one is dolomite, and this one is iron tablet. Um, I took, where is this? I took this one a few days ago for about a week, almost a week, and then I added the iron tablet to the immune booster. Um, but because there is iron in here, but it's not enough. I used to take this one, um, but it makes me nauseous, so I don't always take it. I don't always take multivitamin. I just supplement with what I need. And sometimes if I feel a bit run down, I'll do a moon boost or I'll do a, a multivitamin, you know. Um, and But I have to obviously take my iron as needed. My doctor advised to start taking it like 10 days before my period and then the time of my period and then I should be fine. So like almost like half a month every time. Having this tangerine as a snack. Right, I'm just taking my dog for a quick walk. Don't know how far we're gonna go. Can't go too far. Look at him. Okay, we're going now. We're going now, boy. All right, all right, all right. Okay, and then I'm gonna make some lunch and hopefully, hopefully edit. Actually, I'm supposed to do a video today, like do a recording, but I don't know if I'm gonna do that. We'll have to see. I still have to clean the house. Right, you can see this one is all ready to go. Hold on, sweetheart. And she likes to join us, but she doesn't go far, she doesn't go too far. Right, we're walking. Yay, let's go. Come on, thank you. Alright, so I'm going to boil some eggs for myself. Two eggies. Toast, so this is just a normal slice.
so I am <clears throat> so cute I'm about to go out and just um, read a book and I just really want to get some sun I want to get like 10 minutes of sun 10 to 20 minutes of sun every day I think it will be good for my overall health because I do lack vitamin D and I don't want my levels to get very very low because I know that contributed to me being really um, ill the last time so I just want to try and get some sun on a regular basis this dog he's about he really wants to go with but I don't want him running around outside so. I want to enjoy myself and not worry about him right so here's a vegetable curry I made and I've got a lot of potatoes in here so I don't have any rice um, I think if I'm gonna make rice tomorrow because I would like some rice with it it's like a sweet and sour then I will dish just a little bit less nothing fancy mushrooms and butternut some beans and what else did I say potatoes and some peppers and onions yeah it's a sweet and sour type of curry i'm watching some youtube while i while i'm mixing up my protein um pancakes and then i'm gonna let it sit while i do a quick exercise i just want to actually do a a hip opening exercise today and um, then I can have some breakfast I woke up really late because I felt I don't feel so good didn't have a good night's sleep so this is gonna be breakfast I've got my I've got my peanut butter over here. I've got these are actually two pancakes that's been stacked with peanut butter on. I have to wash those strawberries and then I have the last pancake about done. So it's already afternoon and I've made three little pancakes. There's a one under there. And I added some peanut butter, two strawberries. That's one cut up. That's one that's halved, and this is another one. Um, because it's already lunchtime, almost lunchtime, I decided to add a tangerine because um, I need something a little bit more filling. I hope this is gonna fill me up, but this is breakfast. <coughs> just to let you know, I'm not fasting on purpose. It's my dog. I just woke up late because I had pain in my ankles last night so I was up all the night and so I slept in a bit this morning just three very thin layers We're not drinking from that. Come, 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 come. I'll give you some water inside. <laughs> what did you do that for? Alrighty. Oh gosh. Back home. So, this is one cup of cooked brown rice. And over here is my lunch, which is steamed broccoli, two tablespoons. It's almost like half a cup of brown rice and a boiled egg with some paprika and cayenne pepper and salt. That's it. Cake had a lot of flavor for all of you. Right, so this is a cup of cooked rice at the bottom, and then I just put my curry on top. And I still have enough curry for I think about two, maybe three helpings. I was thinking of adding some peas, but Hmm, I wasn't sure and I've got some mixed veg as well I could add but I'm really not feeling this the rest of the day today I'm feeling quite I'm not feeling so 
I've got a bit of a headache today. So, and it's just getting worse. So, I've done all my housework. I've done everything that I wanted to do for the day. So, or most of the things. So, yeah, I think I'm just going to relax. I'm, like, hungry still. So, I think I'm just going to um, grab a nachi and have this. I also have some protein coffee. Just waiting for it to cool down, so I'm gonna have this and some protein coffee. So right now I'm going to have my breakfast and I'm also getting a little bit of vitamin D in for the morning. my setup here I decided to make a quick cake got my mix in there baking powder flour got my eggs at the back and my sugar and my oil and I'm just gonna go preheat the oven and then get started
melody put aside put aside oh i'm vibing to a song that i don't know i shouldn't be thinking about tomorrow i shouldn't be thinking about tomorrow I could go to outer space. Outer space. Outer space. Then my worries would be out of sight. Too far away. I wish I had a hiding place. Hiding place. For all my obligations just to clear my mind. Get away. Almost a damn oopsie. Almost a damn oopsie. So glad I tasted that. Sugar needs to mix. Oh. I'm gonna let this cake stand a little bit, like three or four minutes. Because the problem for me is. If I put the sugar in earlier, it would have dissolved a little bit better by now. Oh, it's looking better. It would have been ready for the pan. But now I'm sitting with adding the sugar so late. It is dissolving. But I need a few minutes. Taste this. I'm going to let the cake sit a little bit so the granules can dissolve and then give it a light mix before I pour it into the baking tray. I'm just going to clean up the kitchen quickly while I wait for this to, you know, um, what do you call it, melt into the mixture basically. I'm 
it's probably been like not even a lot like two minutes or so since I've switched off but I don't have a lot of time I want to get this cake in because it takes about 40 minutes to bake and I want to get it in because um, send some to my son because he's got um, he's got practice going on and then he have to stay after school well, practice is after school but then he has to stay to help out with a food fee or something so he did that last night as well and so I know he's tired I just want to send himself my cake to brighten his day and this was like a last minute thing also, my tenant is moving in today, so I'm baking a cake quickly. Um, this will be the last I can use that oven until I buy myself an oven. Right, so my cake's been out of the oven for about 20 minutes. It's been resting. I'm going to turn it out and then just um, let it cool in the cooling rack. You can see it's a bit cracked, and that's because the oven was... Um, preheated for a little bit too long I think it the oven was just slightly too hot when I popped the cake in but other than that it looks good Too bad. I'm happy with it. It's now 20 minutes past 2 and I'm sort of ready for lunch. Right, so I just cut the cake. It's lovely. Um, I packed all those in for my son and my husband had a PC and I'm just going to sample a PC like this because I don't want to like overdo it with the cake. And oh, it's nice and soft and bouncy. Um, if I feel like some tonight, I'll see. I might have some, I don't know. We'll see. So I've got some mixed veg and a egg going in the pan. And it's not an omelette because I don't think structurally that pronounced properly. I don't know. But I don't think it will hold up if I flip it because I think two eggs would perform better or if there was anything else in it. But that's it, so I'm not even gonna. I'm gonna sort of attempt. I always attempt. But yeah, it's not an omelette, it's just a mix of stuff. <laughs> I cannot believe that I actually achieved success. Perfectly done. Whoa. I'm gonna add some cheese. Right, so I folded it over successfully, I think. You can see the cheese melt on the yum. And a little bit of. Um, tomato sauce now I could have this with a slice of toast or something but the reason that I'm not having a carb is is because it's 335 right now and I'm probably going to have supper in an hour and a half or so so I don't really want to spoil my appetite but I want to eat something because I haven't had a proper lunch so yeah this is what I'm having. When I'm hungry, I eat. I do not starve myself. Because um, that's not good for my health. I was just busy. I baked the cake. And then I was doing some editing. I started editing shorts again yesterday. So I did two more. And I did one voiceover as well. For the one clip. So I got sort of busy. And that's why I delayed my lunch was on purpose but if I'm hungry I do eat
can you get back? Get back in, sweetheart. Get back in. Come on, Nancy. Okay. Do not expect that.